Hey guys, today we're diving into an awesome way to upgrade a website by adding smooth scrolling animation in Wix Studio. This effect works wonders for portfolio sites, modern business pages, and any project that needs an extra bit of movement and style. Ready? Let's jump in. Go to Wix Studio. Add a background image, set scroll effect to disappear, and responsive behavior to fit to screen. Now go to Add Elements and choose a text mask. Adjust the font size, color, and position of the text. Now add a paragraph. Replace the text and adjust it as well. Then duplicate it. And once again, select all the text and click Stack. Now click on the main section and change the position type to Sticky. Set the sticky position to bottom and top. Add a new section and remove the background color. Apply advanced CSS grid. Set the grid structure to one column by five rows and set the height of each row to 100 viewport heights. Now go to Add Elements and add a container. Stretch it to fit the full section. Hold Shift to select multiple cells. Remove the background color. Rename the container for convenience. And hide it for now. Add another container. Stretch it. And remove the background color for it as well. Add an image. Resize it. And replace it. Set the position type to sticky. Duplicate the container and assign the second container to row 2. Repeat the same steps with the other images. Move the shrink container up and make it visible again. Go to Animations and Effects and choose the scroll animation. Select the first image. Change in to out and add the shrink animation. Adjust it. Repeat the same steps with the remaining images adjusting the settings. Next one, scale 75%, animation area 30 to 45%. For the third image it's going to be scale 80%, animation area 45 to 60%. For the fourth one, we'll set scale to 85%, animation area 60 to 75%. And the last one, scale 90%, animation area 75 to 90%. Click Publish, and that's it! You've just added a pro-level scrolling effect to a Wix Studio site. Let me know in the comments how it worked for you, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.